Hi there, my name is Karen Andrews and I blog at the blog Miscellaneous Mum and I'm here today to give you my three top tips uh, for when it comes to blogging which hopefully will assist you when it comes to yours. Now my first tip is to choose a blog topic or a niche that you're passionate about. Uh, this is really important because no matter whatever it is that you're trying to achieve in your own personal blogging journeys, whether it is to make a name for yourself or to teach others or to inspire or just simply for the pleasure of writing itself, um, what the passion will do is help sustain you through all of the peaks and troughs when it comes to um, your blogging journey because there will be ups and there will be downs and it uh, is what I would call like your soul so sonar because your passion like it'll always be there sort of pinging out sort of seeking out other sort of things that you can talk about or sort of absorb into your blogging journey and then um, it'll come back to you as well so passion is key and is crucial to your blogging success I think. The second tip I have for you is to value your readers. Um, when I began blogging nearly seven and a half years ago, um, blogs looked very different back then to what they do now, but one thing has always been a constant and that is um, to really relish and embrace your audience once you have developed one because no matter, I think, what, virtually no matter what other kind of blog you have, all blogs or bloggers would love a following and so you, there when you do attract and then sustain these readers that you have um, over the months or years of your journey to definitely um, make them feel valued and whether that is just say, simply thanking them for sort of their support uh, and loyalty or whether it is you want to do something more like offer giveaways or create um, a free ebook or something for them to download and for them to use for their own sort of like gifts. Um, all those sorts of things are appreciated as well. Uh, every year I send out an email to uh, all my read, uh, commenters throughout the year to thank them for their um, yeah, support of me and um, I know that that is appreciated by them. And my last tip is uh, one that's probably the hardest one to <laughs> do and that is to be consistent and uh, not only is consistency um, sort of recognized um, by SEO uh, people who give tips because the more constant you are in terms of uh, posting to your blog like your a regular schedule that you can can keep and upkeep uh, is valued not only by you know the um, SEO purposes but by your readers as well and that goes back to sort of keeping something that they can want to tune back into or, or see um, come back and wanting to see whatever it is that you're putting out for them and also to um, but that doesn't necessarily mean it has to be every day as well. You keep to whatever kind of consistency that you are comfortable with and that you think is sustainable. And whether that is blogging once a week or maybe a bit less than that or a bit more than that, uh, whatever is your uh, sort of safe zone is one that you should try to keep up because that kind of uh, regularity also helps keep uh, some accountability yourself as well so you know about what, it, what it, it is you need to sort of put the bar at and keep that bar at that height and then maybe striving to go beyond that in times where you feel like you can make that stretch or, or take it to the next level. So there are my tips and uh, I hope that they are helpful and um, I wish you all success is in your own blogging journeys. So thank you.